In this tutorial, I will give tips and tricks on how to model form concepts within Vasari by using and understanding design options before going into the modeling phase. First tips I want to explain, that is, I always use design options for the different form concepts. First of all, you will always create more than just one concept and instead of having all these different concepts in different files with Vasai you have the option of having different design concepts within the same file. Therefore I want to show how to create design option first as a short introduction to that. You can access the design option down here. Design option consists of two parts. The design set, that's the headline so to say, and the design option that is the different design alternatives. So you create new sets by clicking on new and you can always rename them. And then for the design options I always have an empty one so I can select a specific design option in the view and when I have an empty one with no, with no objects I can always have an empty view with nothing. That's a very good tip because I'm also using design options in the view. And then I just create as many I need of these design options with different form concepts. You have to create a set before you can create an option. And the option you just click down here under option. So the first one I rename to empty and then the next one option one and so on. And then there is some that is called primary. And those options that is marked as primary will be shown in the main model when I have to select that. So as default it always the main model you see and then you can say all right, this option 7 in this case is the option that is decided to work with and detail later on. So the primary is shown when the model is in main model. I will create a new option here to show some tricks about modeling with sign options. Click on new and then we will just write option 12 because the last one was called 11 and then close. Just to end the talk about design option, down here we have what is the shown one, in this case the main model, and as I said earlier, it will show this that is called option 7. The reason for it's not shown in this view, that is because under my visibility override settings, under the design option tab, it's overruled that, for example, the mask concept that is chosen, the empty one, and the empty one, that is the one with no geometry within. And as we also can see over here in project browser, the name of this view I have called 3D context, so this view is only for the context. So let's take this one instead that is called 3D mass and context. And here we see we have a design proposal. And if we look at the visibility settings again here, go to a design option, then there is selected automatic. And that means it will take either what is shown in the main model or over controlled by the selection down here. I will show it. For now I just cancel this one and click here. So it's option 7 that is shown and if I take option 10 then it will be option 10 that is active and shown. And we can see everything else is grayed out. So it's now it's only possible to select the geometry within this design option. But I can select the other geometry if I deselect this one active only. Then I can select other stuff that is not within this design option. Let's go back to the main model. At the moment there is nothing in the model because all of the different design options I have is set to empty as the primary. So that's why there is nothing shown at the moment. This object is placed in the main model and how do I know that? I can see it down here because there is written main model and when there is written main model here it will be drawn in the main model. So this one is not placed in the design options. But if I select it, then I can add to set by clicking down here, select that design set I want to put it into, and I don't want to put it into all of the design options. So I can select every design option and deselect and put it into option 12 and press OK. Then it will disappear and that is because I have set the empty option to be the primary. So if I want to see it again, I need to go to option 12. So this is the active one now, so I can select this one, but now I cannot select stuff in the main model. But I can if I deselect this one, active only. But it's quite nice to not have the opportunity to select stuff from outside the design option. If the object is in a design option, I cannot just move it by add this to another one. 
then there will come this warning that's not possible but if I want to move this from one option to another I need to say Control C on the keyboard and then go to the option you want to copy or move this object over to let's say option 13 and go to modify and paste it could be paste to same place then we'll paste this in the same place then we can create a new post in this new design option until now I've just shown how we can choose different design options in the views but this also works for the schedules so if we click on visibility and graphical rights we have the same option of saying I want to have a specific design option let's say we want to see option 10 and click OK then we will see it change this mask in option 10 is called 32 and this one that is shown here is called mask 21 so we can also overwrite what we see of design options within the schedules as well in the views. The final thing about design options, at a certain point you are going to take a decision about which proposal or form concept is the one you want to detail further on. You can delete the design option by going to design option first select the design set and then say accept primary then this option 11 will be accepted and be moved to the main model so it's not in a design option anymore let's try it accept primary and then this warning come up and say you are about to deleting everything and that's okay because I have decided this is the one sometimes if you have created views that have some kind of relation to that design option it will come up with this message and trying to delete those views some you cannot delete unfortunately but you can deselect these ones that is not grayed out so they will not be deleted and when you have selected those you don't want to have deleted you have to press delete to finish the accept of this design option and as you can see all of the different options for this mask concept is deleted close and now I can select the geometry from the main model level